With the recent storms, I wanted to share one of my top tips on how communities can be more resilient. Flooding is the biggest threat to the UK as a result of climate change and we need to take it seriously. One of my top tips for communities is to have drain markers marking the drains. Um, there'll be a few examples which I'll show you but generally the markers are above the high water level so that if there's a blockage in a drain you know where the drains are because they're marked so instead of searching for them you can find them easily and if they're blocked with leaves um, you're able to remove them safely and easily and actually help your community be more resilient. It was one thing we did in our community, there was a, a flood in an autumn, the water spilled onto the road from the stream and normally it would flow back into the drains but the drains were all blocked with leaves. We were able to locate the drains and rake them clear. The water then went back into the drains and the flood disappeared. So on a number of occasions, we've actually managed to stop the community flooding. So I think this is a fantastic top tip that communities should do to become more resilient to flooding. I'd also recommend looking at our community flood resilience kits. These have been specially designed for communities. The kits we offer include a range of products. We have small, medium and large kits to suit all community sizes. Um, they have water gates, water pumps, hydro sacks, um, even things down to foil blankets, alcohol gel, head torches, so that your community can be as resilient as possible to flooding. One of our proudest projects was actually with a community in Devon. It was part of a DEFRA Pathfinder scheme. We supplied a water gate barrier and it was used in anger and saved 12 homes from flooding. They rolled out the barrier, it held the water back and protected the community. If we all work together we can help improve flood response and reduce the flood risk across the UK.